I've been calling you for the past two minutes. I'm sorry, hon. I, I had my headphones on. I couldn't... Just think. answer, all right? Okay. I was, I was just packing. Have you seen my keys? No. I, have you checked your pockets? You sure we're supposed to be here? It's not like trespassing or anything. It's not as if I'm like the owner's daughter or anything. Yeah, forgot about that. I was thinking tomorrow maybe we could go walk around the camp. Yeah, that's great. What's for dinner? I think I just saw someone pass the door. It's probably just a deer. Yeah, you're right. 
It probably was. Come back to bed. Jesus, Tim, you gotta get rid of this truck, man. Tch, hell no, man. This thing's an antique at this point. This is a man's truck. There's nothing truly wrong with it. It does have a small gas leak, but it's nothing to be concerned about. Oh, well, if it's no big deal, then whatever. Tim, are we there yet? Does it look like we're there yet? No. I swear to God, Chris, if you ask me one more time if we were there yet, I will pull over and I will leave you on the side of the road. Babe, don't be so violent. Violence is never the answer. Love always wins. And why would you want to do such a thing to that, like that to your brother? Oh, God, Lauren, no one's to hear any of that hippie bullshit. Ha, huh, you said shit. Hey, watch it. Andy, that is not crap. You're just a hater. <laughs> Did you just say hater? How old are you? Quiet, all of you. So, what's the name of this place we're going? It's called Camp CH. It's an old Boy Scout camp that shut down in 1983 because it was deemed haunted. People reported seeing strange things like werewolves, wendigos, and strange humanoid creatures. One that was noted several times was a feral human, very emaciated and pale, that had long, sharp claws on its hands. Some people say the woods gave them an eerie feeling. There were a few disappearances involving it, but authorities looked into it and they couldn't find anything. Oh my God, that's so freaky. Did that actually happen? No, it's just a stupid story that Tim found on the internet. <laughs> Well, it's just an urban legend, so I figure we can go and we can just kind of hang out at the camp and explore the camp. Man, that's a little freaky. What the stories are true? If you're really still that concerned, I do have my gun on me. It's a nine mil, I just got it. It's awesome. <laughs> oh my God, guns too? You were so paranoid. Tim, I don't even know why you brought him. He's such a- A, a, a what? Of what say it? Shut up, both of you. You both are annoying. And yes, Andy, you are a little paranoid. Are we there yet?
gosh, it's so pretty. Too hot. What the heck was that? It's, I don't know, it's probably just a bird or something. Tim, I don't know, man. There ain't a bird in the world that sounds like that. Paranoid idiots. Hey, Chris, you want to come help me prep dinner? Sure, what are we having? Uh, I'm thinking teriyaki chicken. Sounds good. Hey, could you get the chicken marinating? Yeah, I can do that. Thanks, it's just in the cooler. <sighs> Great dinner, babe. It's very good. Oh, thank you. Yeah, no, actually, um, it, it was, it was pretty good. Oh my gosh, a comment from Andy. Wow. <sighs> crazy. Hey, kiddo, what do you think about it? It's pretty good. That's good, I'm glad you like it. Oh, thank you for helping me with dinner. No problem. Andy, Andy, wait, 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 wait. Why'd you follow me? I want to come with you, and I just, just don't want to be stuck with Tim back there. Okay, fine, let me. Did you, uh, did you tell him that you were coming? I think. So, where exactly are we going? Tim told me there was a waterfall down this way. I, I you know, I figured we could check it out. What's wrong? Why do I look so dead? It's the middle of summer. Look, Andy, I think I see it. This is gorgeous. It really is. I'll have to bring Tim and Lauren back tomorrow. That's amazing. We're not allowed to ride that yet. Just a bunch of falls. We're in, we're in nature. Just, just be in nature. Be in, be in nature.
You think, boy, can we go back now? Yeah, all right, we can go back. But you said that we are going back to Can. We'll go back soon. I just wanted to check out the other side of the valley. Hey, look, a cave. I know something interesting. Hey, be careful. I don't know if it's a good idea for you to go in there. Hello? Give me one name here. Andy? I just took that one there. Yeah, it was probably just an animal. Leave it alone. You ready to go now? Yeah. Most funny in there. Yeah, it smells like something died in there. Come on! It's like everything within a mile of us is dead. It's, it's just so eerie. Andy, can we stop for a minute? I mean, do we really have to? It's getting dark. Hey, what you say? Killing me and J just for a minute, please. All right, fine. There's a log we can sit on. Andy, can I have my DS back? Yeah. What are you even playing? Super Mario. Really? I love Mario. Which one? Uh, 64. 64, the DS one? Yeah. Is that the, that's the one with Yoshi and, um, and like Wario and uh, Luigi in it, right? Yeah. I love that one. Because, like, I love how innovative the first one was to the video game industry, but I really love the DS one. I feel like there's a lot more to do in the DS one. I think the mechanics work better. A lot of people complain about playing on like the D-pad, but I like it. I mean, maybe that's just because I played it a lot, but I got really used to it. I mean, they had 30 more stars to it. I know. I mean, I know a lot of them are like, you know, like eight red stars or whatever, but I think... They, they added bunnies. Yeah, the bunnies are fun. Way more bunnies. And the, the extra games. Oh yeah. Those are fun. It's getting dark. We should we should keep going. Yeah, you're right. All right, buddy, I think it's time for bed. But, but I'm not tired. Too bad, I don't care. Go to bed. Uh, fine. I know, I know, it sucks, it sucks. I am so tired. I think I'm gonna get ready for bed. I was up all late last night doing like reading and watching TV I and- you said you were going to bed. I am. Then why are you still talking? <sighs> I'm going. Finally, I can sit in a chair. Oh, stop it. Your girlfriend? <laughs> It's a bitch. Mm. I'm going to get a nice Italian dish. I want it to be a nice Italian dish. I don't want it to be a, a $15 take the family out to Olive Garden. I, I just, I, I don't, I don't, I don't, I don't get it. I don't think the breadsticks are that good. 
I agree. And nobody, you agree. And you're and you're paying you're paying the prices. For yeah, because nobody nobody prices. nobody agrees with me. Everyone loves those breadsticks, and I don't. I don't get it. No, I don't get it. Yeah, uh, uh, just don't drink, I guess. <laughs> so you, <sighs> friggin' loser. Gotta go pee. Them come out and they're just trying to scare me. What is it, buddy? Chris got dragged in the woods. Come on, let's go. Some sort of a, a, a pale creature with with, with with claws, with Chris, you can't be dead, buddy. Come on. Tim, I'm so sorry. We have to go get Lauren and get out of here, okay? The thing that did this to him, it's still out there. And we have to get her and get out of here, man. Tim, come on, we have to go. I am so, so sorry about your brother. But right now, we have to make sure we're okay. He's gone. It's not going to change. Okay. Fine. I'm going to go get Lauren. We'll bring the truck around. We'll come back for you. Lauren, Lauren, you need to get up right now. What? What? What are you talking we about? We need to go to the truck right now. It's so late. Why? Why do we need? Look, to go you need to, to just truck? trust me, okay? We need to go to the truck right now. Come on. What's going on? Chris is dead. The thing that Tim was talking about. It's 
seems like that's what attacked him. And Tim is distraught, and he stayed with him. And I said I would go get you, and so that's what I did. And now we're gonna go get Tim. Son of a bitch! Yeah, the gas leak that we have, a lot worse than we thought. We're out. Shit. Stay here. I'm gonna get Tim. Be safe. Car's out of gas. The line's cut. So sorry. But right now you need to give me your phone. Shit. Nobody has reception out here. I promise you, we're gonna get out of here. I think it's gone for now. I think, I think the logical thing to do is to stay here for the night. Why don't you get some sleep? We'll head out in the morning. Um, why don't you call in the back? I'll keep guard, get some sleep, come on. I'll take care of things out here. We have about 11 hours of daylight left and a lot of ground to cover. We need to get moving. So, if we came in this way, we're gonna head back the way we came and hope that we can get to the road in the time that we have. Oh. It's 25 ish miles. In 11 hours. I think we can do it. But 
We need to hurry. And what if we don't make it out before You know, my grandmother got me a snail for my birthday one year and they were both still faster than you. Can we please stop? I'm tired and I'm hungry. Oh my God, you got any cheese with that wine? See, the, the joke is that you're, you're an obnoxious whiny person. Uh, five minutes. Um, Lauren, I'm sorry. I'm sorry I said those things to you. I shouldn't, I shouldn't have said that to you. I, it's just with, with everything going on, I, I'm scared, Lauren. I mean, I'm really, really scared. I don't know what's gonna happen, but I shouldn't have said that to you. I'm really, really sorry. I, I, I hope. I hope that you can accept my apology. Lauren? Andy, are we going to go, like, you know, take a break? Yeah, yeah, that's cool. That's fine. All right, let's take a break. We just got we just got a little more to go and then this will be over. Just push through. Are you afraid of anything? Yeah. I mean, of course. Well, what are you afraid of? Me. Death for one. Listen, everybody? I guess. I don't know. I never really, really thought about it. Clowns. I'm definitely scared of clowns. Okay, I think we should we should go. Really? Yeah, good idea. I don't want to give you a big head, but we are making pretty good time, but we got to keep going. I don't think so. 
Okay. Jesus, it smells like a dead body in here. Okay, I'm gonna go get something to ra wrap up your your wound, okay? So Great. Yeah, thank you. Be careful. Andy, someone was here. There's someone's back here. Don't go in there. There's another body in there. Shh. There's nothing in any of those bags. They brought pot and booze, and that's it. I mean, the, the cell phones are busted too. And that's pretty bad. I think it's infected. Just leave me. I'm not going to leave you. I'm dead weight. I'm not going to leave you. What, can't we just stay the night? We're, we're already in the cabin. Look, this thing doesn't care if it's night or day. It attacked me in broad daylight. Our best bet is to get back on our feet and make our way towards the edge of camp. We're almost there. Maybe we can make it. I'm so tired, Lauren. I just need a minute. Okay, one minute. Okay, okay, come on. Well, we have to get up. We have to get up. I can't. Here. Take this. I'm dead weight. No, 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 I, I can't, I can't do this. I can't do this without you. Yes, you can. When I say go, you have to run like hell, okay? You can do it. I know you can. <sighs> you can do this. I have faith in you.
I can't do this. What are you waiting for? Okay, you look like hell. Get in this. I'm gonna take you to the hospital, miss. Can you tell me what happened? I just killed the devil. 